Yeah, guys, we are expecting long lines once again here at the super site as both Kamala Harris and Donald Trump make their final last minute push to get first time voters out to the polls. Now we are less than less than 24 hours away from Election Day and the race for the White House is still too close to call. It's why there's been more emphasis on getting young voters who are still on the fence to cast a ballot. And while young voters tend to lean towards more Democratic policies compared to their older counterparts, they're still less likely to vote. But despite the long lines, those we spoke to say it's worth it. I'm loving that I get to be part of it. So far, my parents um, are very into politics, my dad especially, and it was always, I kind of just grew up knowing that I wanted to vote. It feels a little weird, you know, like it's kind of a big deal. And especially like this election, it's so close. And I think like everybody's votes matter this year. Vote is going to count the latest ABC News poll finding Harris leading Trump by 14 points among voters under 30 years old. But right here at home, according to the Chicago Board of Elections, as of last week, Gen Zers under the age of 25 and who are registered represented the smallest percentage of the voting age population who had voted early at just 4%. Well, the super site is going to be open today and on Election Day starting at 9 a.m. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.